Hello everyone. In our previous lecture, we have seen how you can add header and footer in Microsoft Excel. So today I'm going to tell you how you can add date, time and page numbers in the header and footer uh, uh, in the header and footer of Microsoft, uh, of Microsoft Excel worksheets. So let's start with um, with uh, adding the date, then time and then page numbers. So for that, we have to go to the insert tab. I have told you in my previous lecture that you can also add the header and footer by going to the insert tab as well as to the page layout tab. So we'll go to the insert tab. Here we have to go to this text section. Then I'll click here and here we have header and footer. When I click it, it will show me that I can add header here and the uh, and the footer at the bottom. And here we have different options also. So if I want to add a page number, I will click here the page number. I want to add in the center the current date. I will just click on the current date. And if I want to write the sheet name on the right of this uh, at, at the top right or in the header of uh, at, at the right of the header of this worksheet i will just click here so in this way you can easily add the these things by just clicking on these options you have also other options like page number that number of pages the number of pages uh, by using the number of pages option you can add the number of pages to the header or footer by using the page number option you can add the page number the, the itself what is the page number of that worksheet to the um, um, in the excel then current date by using this option current time by using this this is the file path this is file name this is sheet name you can also add picture to the header or footer so i just i have just added the page number the uh, date and the um, here i have also added the sheet name and if you want to add the time it's all on you whatever you want so this this was about header so in order to add the footer we will go here and we can select the different options we can select that we with whether we want to put these three things in the three different portions of the footer that is on the left center and the right so if i uh, want to select this one i will click click on it and i can edit it as i want uh, as i want if I want to write something else here, if I want to something else here, and if I want to something else here, it all depends on me. So this is the way you can add the, uh, the date and the page number and the page um, and the worksheet name in the header and footer. One more thing here, if we go to the page layout and we go here and use this option, this option is more flexible for me by using by adding header and footer by using this option that is by going to the page layout is more flexible for me because I can easily go to the custom header option and here I whatever I want I can do easily like whatever I want to write in left section in the center section in the right section and here are the options that whether I want to add page numbers or the number of pages or date or time for example if i want to add the time i can easily select here and i will add time other than the name of the worksheet so by using oh by clicking ok i can go back and i can go for the custom footer here we can easily access the header and footer at the same time by while by using the insert tab option it becomes sometimes sometimes difficult and confusing for some so i will prefer to add header and footer to add date time and different um, um, date time or page numbers by using this option now this is the footer in the footer if i want to add the page number i can select if i want to add the time i can select and if i want to add the name of the worksheet i can select here or, or file like this is the file path this is the file name and this is the sheet name keep this in mind this is the file name and this is the sheet if i click this it will give me the file name also the sheet name and if i press ok it will bring me back to the header and footer section one more here thing is there are different options here that whether you want to add different to, uh, to if you want different odd and even pages you will check this option if you want different first page you will check this option like normally in uh, word sheets we usually do this that the first page should be different so we need to check this option another important thing is you can also go to the print preview to see, to check how it looks like like if i go to print preview i can see here the headers and the footers so we will go back and then we can easily see that we can we have added the header and footer 
So this is how you can add date, time, page numbers in header and footer. Um, the automatic date, time and page numbers, you need not to add the time, you need not to add the page number separately and it will automatically update it for the rest of the, so it will be automatically updated for the rest of the pages. So its page number are increasing downwards. So you can see here, this was page number one and here we have the page number two and it will be page three, four in the downward, in the, in the, in the downward form. So this is how you can add date, time and page number in header and footer in Excel. That's all from today's lecture. Thank you.